What is up guys and gals? Welcome back to the Nerd Castle. Today we are doing first impressions on a game called Jiji. I don't really know how to say this game. I don't know how to say this game's name is Jij. I don't know J Y D G E. Have no idea Jij. Jij Jij sounds like an offensive word. That sounds like something you would say to somebody and then they would have full recourse to punch you. Either way, we are playing Jij today, which I still don't know if I'm saying it right, but whatever. We're going to figure it out. Uh, it's a game where you're basically Judge Dredd, and you gotta go in, and you gotta own people with your badass, apparently, Winchester gavel. So let's go do this thing. Let's play the game and see what it's got going on. This is Channel Neon reporting live from the crime scene. Multiple citizens are being held hostage as the crime lord and tightens his grip on the city. We're here with the head of Edinburgh Police. Chief, with crime waves reaching all-time high. Do you think now is the time to launch the Judge Initiative? Yes. Send in the Judge. Apparently it's just Judge. We learned a new thing today. I'm learning all kinds of new grammatical and phonetical stuff today. Apparently here we are. Uh, I've got a gun. It looks like it's keeping a tire- we're at Noodle Biscuit. Noodle Biscuit does not sound like the kind of place that I want to go for a meal, but you know, surprise attacks deal extra damage. Okay, so how do I surprise attack- Apparently, I just gun him down. Never mind. Forget due process of the law. Murder everyone. There's another dude over here. Oh, shit. That guy's got lasers. No, I don't think I'm okay with this. Did he just drop money? Ooh. There we go. Asset forfeiture. That's how we get it done right there. We can confiscate some goodies over here. Got them goodies for me. All right. Well, let's go ahead and I want this over here, too, then. If I don't have it, hold on. I'm stealing money real fast. Don't worry. I'm going to rescue you in a minute as soon as I steal some money. So if they're out of the building, are we good? Rescue hostages and keep them safe. Well, I should probably follow them then. Citizen rescued! Hell yeah, they are. And then I broke somebody's fruit strand. I broke somebody's fruit stand too, because apparently I'm just kind of a dick like that. Let's go ahead and do some sweet burnouts right here. So everybody like, yeah, law enforcement with gun. Oh, we can't burn out when we fly. Damn. Welcome to the Judge Control Center. Play missions to earn medals and confiscate credits to unlock more powerful gear and features. Okay, so for 500 bucks we can get a cybernetics lab. Let's go ahead and do that. It's vaguely reminiscent of, like, uh, Syndicate is kind of what it reminds me. You remember that menu? Dude, that shit was so badass the first time I played Syndicate when I was a kid when I find out you could do, like, cyberware on people. You could, like, replace their arms and stuff like that. That was the coolest thing ever. Cyberware augmentation module is now activated. Configure Judge to your liking. Okay. I, I don't know what I can configure on him, but we got Electrocute. Automatically zaps nearby hostiles with bolts of electricity. All citizens have 100 times more health. Or we can go with Reduces Incoming Damage. I'm going to go with Lightning coming out of my ass, because I feel like that'll probably intimidate enemies better than anything else. Like, a big-ass dude rolls up in here with a gun. That's already terrifying enough. But then he just starts belching lightning everywhere that he goes. That's when, that's when I start to get really concerned. We also have our Gavel. Which apparently we just have lead bullets for right now. Perps exacited. <laughs> God. Alright, well, we've got house arrest, rescue the hostages, loot all containers, and exit in 20 seconds. I suppose I can do that. Let's do this thing. Let us infiltrate and hurt. Infiltrate and maim. So we've got 20 seconds to wipe these cats out. Alright. Oh man, they killed a citizen? How did they kill a citizen? I'm not sure how that happened right there. Hold on. We gotta give this another go. Did my window breaking kill the citizen? Or did he just self-destruct and kill a citizen? Because we've got 20 seconds to do this thing. And that's the part that worries me. Yup. Get dealt with, bad guys. Get dealt with. Oh shit, they're coming at me. No! There's a dead citizen! Mistrial. It's not called, it's not called ridiculous enforcement overreach. It's called a mistrial. There we go, I've saved a hostage. I am the hostage saver. Ow! I've been shot. That hostage is also being- Ow! Apparently I've been eliminated. Okay, so there's a little bit of like a Hotline Miami thing going on. You definitely want to be up in here, and you want to be careful about it, but you also want to be precise and you want to be deadly. That's what I'm learning today. I'm gonna get that guy right there. So there's a dude down. Uh, inside this room. See, that's the thing, is they're going to try and get you by making you go, Oh, I knocked those dudes off the building. Okay, so let's confiscate some goods. There we go. We'll go rescue. We're going to confiscate a good over here. It's already been over 20 seconds. And then I'm going to shoot that guy right there. And did we get everybody? All citizens rescued. Okay. 
Citizens, I have rescued you. Be aware that death will be implemented. You have been found guilty. Six months, ISO Cube. Oh, we didn't make the time limit. But we didn't also, oh man, I didn't loot all the containers neither. Do I get, is that like, ooh, there's a new fire mode. Fires a herd of hot lead, very brutal at close range. Okay, so we can do a shotgun now. So we only got one pip right there. I'm gonna try and do better. I gotta do better here. We gotta get at least two pips on this thing. We got the back alley beat. Let's do this. How do they not know when I'm pulling up? See, this guy, I think, is the most dangerous because he's got a civilian right there. That's just like, he's not, oh no, I almost got lasered. Is that goods right there? What is that? Oh, you're dead. Oh, you're dead. You have been enforcement eliminated. What is this right here? I picked up like a cog or something. I'm gonna rescue you. I don't see any other loot around. Where's the other loot at? Oh, there's a little storehouse back here. Is that a good guy or a bad guy? That's a bad guy because my lightning decided. You're a bad guy because lightning has deemed you to be so. So we've got the metal for looter all done. All right, well, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do, man. Civil forfeiture's a bitch, ain't it? Let's go ahead and jump in the car and be the hell up out of here. I like it though, it's got kind of a cyberpunk flair to it and it feels a little bit tighter than I expected it to feel. Like, I don't know, I felt the game to feel kind of loosey-goosey, but at the same time, it does, there we go. We got another pip right there that makes me feel better. So we got a bank robbery on this side. If I wanted to upgrade my gavel, so it's 1500 for a shotgun. I don't really want a shotgun. But can I, for 2500 I can buy a new slot over here. And I think that's probably a good idea, too. I'm going to unlock a new slot. And let's make it so that we take less damage. I'm going to put on some body armor. Because it seems like the sort of thing a policeman would need if he was going into this kind of... They all need to die. Bank robbers open the wrong safety deposit box. They got to go. I bet I'm being used. That sounds like a sinister mission right there. Doesn't it feel like we're protecting somebody evil? Why does somebody have to die because they looked inside of a safe deposit box? What was inside that safe deposit box? I kind of feel like as a judge, or as like Judge Dredd, I should probably look and be like, Hey... This is actually incriminating evidence towards like a major public figure. So I need a key to get inside of there. Never mind. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this dude. All right, he's down. I'm gonna confiscate the loot. Confiscate the loot. Dude, there's so much loot in here. Let's confiscate loot for a minute. I'm all about loot. Hell yeah. Stay on it. This guy's got a key back here. That's an auto door, which I didn't expect, but I'm glad that we were able to adapt to it fast enough. Uh, we need a key to get in here. Alright, so Mr. Black is down. Mr. Pink, however. Dude, our, our accuracy here is actually kind of terrible. This dude need to bring his accuracy game up hard. Like, look at that spray and pray. Like, you know you're not supposed to fire a gun from your hip, right? I mean, we already lost our untouchable thing, so we might as well kill him now. So we've got all the enemies. It looks like there's a bunch of goodies in here, though. A hacking tool is required. Okay, maybe I'll get a hacking tool later. I don't have a hacking tool right now. But I'm going to stay here. I'm going to get paid out. I mean, I already messed up the mid... Ooh, hey, what's up? Apparently, if a judge goes into a bank, he is allowed to systematically rob that place if he wants. There we go. I got to drop some of these cat. Oh, shit. There's a lot of these dudes. All right, spray the field. Spray the field. Yup, drop them. A little bit of a bullet hell mechanic there too, especially if they're going to be tracking how much you get hit based on your bonuses. Uh, it seems like it's probably a good idea not to get hit, but there are a lot of bullets in the air and you do have to sneak through some pretty tiny corridors. I mean, not like bullet hell level corridors, but close. Can I destroy this wall right here? Like, how do I get back into this area that I want to be in? Because there's loot. I mean, I guess I could use the door, but that's for, that's for citizens. I'm not a citizen. I am a judge. I do what I desire when I desire it. There we go. We'll waste that guy real fast. We got all enemies down. And I think, I don't know what these are right here, but hell, I assume it's good enough. I don't see anything back here in the turlets. So, is there anything inside that door right there? What is this? A yellow key is required to go inside of there. Is there even a yellow key on the map? Oh, we gotta find a yellow key now. This is important to me. I like little secret goodie areas. All I've got is a red key for right now, though. What does the red key go to? I'm curious. So I looked all around the map, and I don't see anything that takes a red key. Like, it's possible that I just, like, missed it or whatever, but I looked around, and I didn't see nothing that takes a red key. So let's just bounce up out of here. This mission's taking too many resources, too many allocations. There are more citizens to maim. Sentence executed. 
So it's thousand dollar bonus right there for both of those. Probably could have got a perfect mission right there, but uh, that's the way life goes. Shadow blend. Enemies cannot see you when you are in the dark. That's pretty sweet and sexy. I would think about it. The office retaliation. As far as this goes, what does special fire do? Devastating special weapons. Shoot rockets and more by pushing the special button. So, bigger, meaner, ooh, heavy rockets. I like rockets. Rockets are what's up. What's the special weapon button, though? King should probably tell me. What's the what's the special weapon button? So, special weapon button is just right click. Okay, I suppose that makes sense. And as far as the rest of our cash goes, we've only killed three civilians. We've only killed three civilians. I'd like to think that we're pretty good at this job. Two missions, three civilian casualties. I'm sure it's fine. It'll work out. I, I bet this will have no career ramifications for us. An influential citizen has been taken hostage at the Cyberhand's office. Make sure the hostages make it to the elevator. Rescue the hostages. Don't take any damage. Exit in 30 seconds. All right. I can do this. I have rockets. Let's go. 30 seconds. Got to make this thing work. Oh, we need a red key to get in there. Okay, 30 seconds might not work anymore. Can I shoot through that window? So there's our red key right there. I'm going to waste that dude. He's down. Uh, we've got some loot over here. Dude, 30 seconds to get in here? Good lord. I'm barely inside the building right now. Ow, I've been shot. Damn it, now i got to restart the mission. I didn't mean to get trapped in a corner. It just kind of happened. I wasn't trying to get trapped in a corner. It's just every now and again you try to take cover, man. All right, so we know our way around this time, so we won't waste time. There we go. He didn't hear the sound of the gunshot, but he definitely heard the sound of his head hitting the pavement. There's another one bites the dust. Let me get up in here and see what I can find. Was there any loot in there? No, but there's a key in here. And I like keys. You might call it a kiosk. I'm going to grab some confiscated goods. Ooh. That was pretty rad. Yeah, let's eliminate these dudes. I got rockets, son. I got rockets, and I just don't give a damn. The judges are here! I'm not going back in an ISO cube. Citizen, stand down. Dude, Judge Dredd is so badass. How do you not like Judge Dredd? Judge Dredd is awesome. I mean, the Sylvester Stallone Judge Dredd, man. But, like, real Judge Dredd. Real Judge Dredd is what's up. That's a dope-ass... It's a cool comic, man. It's a cool movie, too. If you haven't seen the one that has Carl Urban in it, there we go. Uh, that citizen almost got tagged, but I think we're going to be... Oh, that's a grenade. Let's maybe not get blown up by that. But he did make a convenient door wall. Get out of here. Leave the area, citizen. There we go. So we got the citizens up and out of here. That looks like a medical robot. So they're going to make it to the elevator. Is that everybody? All right, so that's everybody. Health is full, so that robot looks like it's there to like help us and make us more healthy. It's there to give us superior potassium. I'm all out of rockets. I wanted to blow out that wall right there. I was pretty excited about it, too. Damn, I thought that I just had, like, infinite rockets. They were just, like, maybe on a cooldown or something. So what's up with... He's got some more loot over here. Obviously, we should 100% confiscate that, because what kind of person other than a guilty one keeps $1,000 in their office? And then we have a red key, but that went to, like, the back door. What's up with the elevators over here? Can I go in these? I can? Where do they go? Nowhere? They're just kind of there? Alright, well, never mind then. I was hoping there's going to be like a secret underground complex that I could get to. But no. No secret underground complex for Splat. I don't know in what universe you were supposed to do that in 30 seconds. But I'll tell you this much. So we need a hacking tool to get in there. How do I get a hacking tool? Maybe the missions stay unlocked once you've done the things that need to be done. So that on replays, you don't have to get the key anymore. You can just like go through different doors rescue the hostages and like boogie out maybe that's what it is maybe it actually is not possible to do from the default starting but as you start to unlock doors and get things done then it becomes a lot better and a lot faster maybe that's what they're going for I don't know new fire mode plasma short range but high damage bolts of plasma cyberware we've got Liam the laser drone a friendly companion drone armed with a laser assists you well what's not to love about a death robot what's not to love about a death robot everybody loves a death robot Death robots are what's up. Eliminate the leader, loot all containers, and leave in 25 seconds. I don't see that happening, but hey, let's go ahead and do this thing. There's been a riot. Citizens, stand down. Your resistance is unnecessary. You will succumb to the law. That guy's got a missile launcher. I don't know how I feel about this. 
I mean, I tell you how I feel. He's dead now. That should be a good enough explanation. Like, when somebody feels really strongly about something, that's when somebody winds up dead. That's like a whole nother level of feeling strongly about things. That guy's got a rocket launcher, too. God damn, man. They're giving rocket launchers out to everybody out here. Was there a no hit on this one? Loot all containers. Okay, cool. Wow. This riot's kind of out of control. Where are these people getting all these high-powered plasma firearms at? They must be easily accessible. Oh, that's a missile. Then again, if I was fighting a cyborged out doom douche, I'd probably fire a rocket at him too. But you know the fun thing about rockets? I have them too, asshole. Alright, so that guy's down. We gotta loot all the containers. There's Rayron up here. Go ahead and confiscate that cash real quick. Hey, Rayron. You wanna get shot? Oh, I blew myself up with a rocket launcher. Apparently, there's friendly splash fire. Things to be aware of. Okay. We learned a new thing about jidging today. I learned how to jidge better. Alright, let's try this again. Gunfire! Dead guys, pigeons flying in the sky. Gonna shoot some dudes down here because they're super lame. There it is. Law enforcement has gotten somewhat easier in the future. You don't really have to like mess around with like questioning people, like figuring out who done it. You basically just gotta kill them off. You just roll in and be like, you are guilty of shoplifting. Returning the socks is too late. You must die. And then you eliminate them. They shoplifted socks. In the monologue that happened in my head, they, they shoplifted socks. Goodbye. Small children. Shoplifting candy bars just gunned down in broad daylight. Like, well, the judge system is kind of working. I mean, civilian casualties have gone up considerably. We don't really talk about that part, though. We always talk about, like, successful initiatives and how everything is going great. All right, so in here we got a rocket launcher dude. He's got to go right now because that guy's dangerous. That guy looks kind of dangerous, too. He's trying to hit me with a pipe, I think. Damn, dude. Holy shit. That guy got shot so many times. Like, I can't believe how many times that guy got shot and stayed up. Like, he's wearing a t-shirt. Dude, we need to invest in some better bullets. What are we firing, BBs? Good lord. Hollow tip, man. Shredder rounds. Get something that'll sit them down. Like, if you're gonna expect law enforcement, though, you need to, you need to, you need to up the ante here. Oh, have I been struck? I don't think I've been struck, but it doesn't matter, because that's not an objective in this mission. All right, let's confiscate some more 20s. Let's get them 10s, 20s, 50s, 100s. All right, so we got the 10s, 20s, 50s, 100s. And we've got some loot over there. I don't know how comfortable I feel about fighting that guy with the pipe again, because he's faster than me, and he's also deadlier than me. But... He's faster than me, and he has more health, which means I can't get away from him. Once I fire, I could try and get him with the rocket launcher, I suppose. Oh, you are going to get jidged so hard. That guy's got a pretty deadly shotgun. Dude, I need like a bolt action rifle or something that actually has some accuracy. That or this judge needs to spend some more time at the range because he is not doing law enforcement level work here. Man, we gotta stay moving, but while we're moving, I can't seem to hit the bastard. There we go. Rocket launcher worked. That shut him up. That took care of the, par that took care of the problem. Lickety splickety. Maybe I should just rocket launcher the guy with the crowbars. Maybe that'll deal with him. I like the music, though, too. They got a pretty good soundtrack in here. Soundtrack's got kind of like a little bit of a killing floor light thing going on. What's up, guys? Step in my hallway. I will judge you. Come outside. Wait by the light of the neon. There we go. So they've been eliminated. Let's get back up in here. See if we can find anything good. A little bit of loot right there. A little bit of loot so we can scoot. I'm going to reload. I'm going to get them when they come around the corner. Oh, he didn't come around the corner. He was too smart for me. He was too smart for me. All right, Rayron. It is time for your judgment. So Rayron has been eliminated. I'm going to shoot out all these windows this fun. There we go. Shoot. Have you ever shot panes of glass before? It's super fun. Just don't stand too close when you do it. 
It's a blast though. Oh, there's loot right there. Hey, what's up, beautiful loot? Would you like to come with me? Would you like to be friends? Would you like to be friends with my judge wallet? Oh, that was a landmine. I had no idea that was even a mechanic. That's a little horrifying. There are things that exist inside this world that I was just unaware of. Sentence executed. Uh, cyberware, 150% more health. Not bad. I've got $12,000 right now, and it's only been like one day of jidging. We've been jidging super hard. I think that I'll probably go with more health. I don't know. The drone seems pretty rad, though, too. A good heart. I think you can say a lot of things about our judge, but I don't think anybody that actually believes in law enforcement has a good heart if they do the kind of stuff that we've been doing. Gavel mods. Yeah, is there an accuracy mod? Because that's what I want. What we created was something special. Piece of art yet traditional. Even ceremonial. Self-sustained and virtually unlimited primary ammunition. Multiple deadly fire modes. The gavel. My friend. Get ready to deal some sweet ruthless justice. Don't you mean ruthless just ruthless justice? So can I get like an accuracy mod? Because that's what I really need. Uh, fire 360 degree plasma bolts every time you reload. I suppose I'll take that. I mean, that's better than... It's better than nothing, you know? It's better than nothing. Let's play around with the shotgun. Let's see what's going on with that. Although I think this is probably going to be bad for saving civilians. The Cobra Gang hideout. Destroy the death machine. I will destroy it for I am a jidge. What's up, gentlemen? How are you? Oh, that's a pretty cool gun. I like the shotgun. That shotgun's all kinds of fun. Okay, I like that. I mean, it kind of, it's more accurate at long range than the rifle is because of the spread. Like, because of the spread, it's actually more reliable at longer ranges than the rifle is, so at least you put something on somebody whenever you fire it. The judge is here. Bequeath your sins unto me, evildoers. All right, so there's loot in the bathroom, apparently. That's where they like to keep their hideout safe, I guess. I'm gonna blast out this window. That's a civvy right there, so I probably don't want to mess with him too much. How do I get a hacking tool? I need a hacking tool bad. Hmm, maybe someday. Maybe someday. For now, I'm gonna have to go with this wallet tool getting filled up. Hell yeah. That dude got blazed almost instantly. Grab that right there, and then we can knock out a wall right there if we use the explosives. This dude's going to come investigate, but he's going to get blapped on. Yep, I am the Jidge. Let all fear, let all fear the judicial system. No more mercy. No more light sentences. Everyone is destroyed. Oh shit, that's a machine with a machine gun. I think I'm just going to fall back. Ow, 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 ow. Ooh, I killed Orpheon. That's good. I don't know what I'm going to do about his robo friend, but... Did I get it? Oh, I did not. It's just as angry with me right now. I need to get out of this hallway, because this thing's going to hurt me badly if I stay in this hallway. I don't know where it is, though. All I know is that it has a lot more bullets than I have. Where did it go? Oh, it's over there. I'm out of rockets, so... This is kind of a special case situation here. I don't think that door is going to hold. I'm a little bit suspect about the walls, too, but I've got like a sliver of health left. So our main targets have been eliminated. We've got to find out if there's any more loot around here. Because I like getting paid every single day, yay. Uh, we got a little bit right here. I'll take that. Ooh, a health kit. That helps out a little bit. I mean, it's not a lot of health. It's not the kind of health that changes a life, you know what I mean? Like, if we had leukemia, that would be like a band-aid, but... Oh, it opens that door. Oh. Okay. 
I need a hacking tool for that, though, so unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to do much with that. But let's bounce on out. We are the most badass of all the Jidges. My name is Splattercat. Thank you for joining me here for the gameplay impressions of a little indie game called Jidge. Judge. They call it Judge, but I'm calling it Jidge because that's how it's spelled. Anyways, we have electrocited, shot, and destroyed as the dawn of Jidgement. I mean, a lot of Jidgement is happening right now. We're pretty good at Jidging. Ooh, Channel Neon. Channel Neon with a special report. The city of Edinburgh is getting safer as the controversial Judge Initiative keeps rolling out more units to the streets. Dubbed as the Crime Reaper, the Judge is being praised as the new efficient form of law and order. More people are applying for the Edinburgh citizenship, as the city is indeed turning out to be the promised urban paradise. This was Channel Neon, your trusted source of news. Channel Neon, we are definitely not state propaganda. Anyways, I will see you all next time. Thank you for stopping on in. If you wanted to get this game for yourself, ooh, fires fat segments of laser. Ooh, a shock orb. See, now we're starting to get to that good stuff. We're seeing that, ooh, your projectiles don't harm citizens. That'd be kind of nice to have, too. Whoa. There's more objectives now on each one? Or do we have to go back through on... Oh, hardcore mode. Okay, makes sense. I'll see you all later. If you want to get this game for yourself, you can find it down below. Hi to everybody, and I'll see you all in whatever we cover next. Goodbye!